Hi there, it's Kathleen Packett with day number 31 of the Internet Lifestyle Network video challenge. And today's word is praxis. I have spent the day off and on with Bob Proctor as I traveled to my son's for his birthday. Got to spend some time with uh, his beautiful wife and my granddaughter and him. And it was just an awesome day. But when I travel, I like to listen to audio. So today I chose Bob Proctor's um, Challenge, the Poten Challenge Your Potential. And I'm just going to give you the Cliff Notes version of it, of the word praxis. Praxis means the integration of belief with behavior. You might say everyone, you know, integrates their belief with their behavior, but that is not true because your beliefs are not necessarily your beliefs. For example, a belief is that many are walking around with diplomas and they believe that if they got an education that they could get a job but millions are walking around there with the, with the diploma with the knowledge but they don't have the work. Education comes from the Latin word that means to induce, to develop, to grow from within. Education is about developing your God-given powers and being able to demonstrate what you can do with it. It's not, it's what you do, not what you know. So if your results are not to your liking, you want to go back and examine your beliefs. I challenge you to write out all of your beliefs and then look at them as if you were a stranger looking at them. And are they really your beliefs? Or were they beliefs of, you know, your upbringing, your, you know, from the people around you? Did you take on their beliefs as if they were your own? Or did you form them all by yourself? Where did those beliefs come from? It is harmony with the universe that if you integrate your beliefs with the laws of the universe, you will succeed. But they had to be your beliefs. They got to come from you. Analyze your beliefs. Do you have sound reasons for why you believe what you do? As you analyze these, you'll probably find that, find that most of them have no sound foundation as to where those came from or why, why they are. So it's time to, to tap inside of you and who are you really? And if whatever you can believe and if you can envision it, you can then hold it in your hand. That's what praxis is all about, is digging deep and, what you know, combining those two things. You can read my blog more, but I just wanted to get you thinking, look up that word praxis. Maybe grab um, Bob Proctor's audio, as as only Bob can. He just goes into that and just really goes deep with it as far as touching your mind, touching your heart, making you stop and think. He has a way of really making you think about what it is you're doing and why and getting you to move forward getting you to let go of things that don't serve you. Um, mix that with, with the trainings we've got in here at ILN. It's all about expanding your mind, letting go of limiting things that, that limit your potential. Grow. Grow from who you are. Trust yourself. Um, form your own beliefs. Because what was right for somebody else may not be right for you. That may not be congruent with who you are. 
Food for thought. Make it a great day. Peace and success. Kathleen Packett, KathleenPackett.com, I-L-N with Kathleen.com.